Well, we knew it was coming, but now it's been announced. Here we go in the newsroom on Apple.com. All new MacBook Air with the M2 chip, available Friday, July 8th. That's this Friday. Are you gonna get one? I'm gonna get one. Am I gonna keep one? Are you gonna keep one? I, I don't know yet. <laughs> we'll have to do some tests. For software developer tests, do hit that subscribe button. I'll be doing some of those. So the sale is starting at 5 a.m. Pacific time, and the first batch is gonna be delivered on July 15th. Now, the first batch of the MacBook Pros with the M2 chip was delivered pretty quickly, but the first batch only hit eight gigs available, and that small 256 gigabyte SSD. I don't know if they're gonna do the same thing with the uh, MacBook Airs, if they're gonna stagger it. By the way, I did go right to apple.com to buy the M2 MacBook Pro right on time, 5 a.m. Pacific time, which is thankfully not Pacific time for me. It's It was 8 a.m. for me, I'm in Eastern time, but oh, Vadim and Max have to get up early on that day. Anyway, when I started ordering it, the only option available was that eight gigabyte model with the 256 drive. Now, July 15th is the first deliveries of these, but if they don't have the 24 gigabyte model with the larger SSDs available, that might be pushed out to August. Who knows, maybe even September, I don't know. Hopefully they'll have these in stock and available throughout the entire range of MacBook Airs. We'll see about that. But these are also not cheap, starting $1,199. It better be worth it. That's all the news today. My thoughts on the M2 for developers tomorrow.